This photo was posted by Dallas Raddins, a tattoo artist in Regina. It shows the Tasmanian Devil. His headband has a swastika and two S's on it. The swastika, most known as the symbol of the Nazi regime, and the SS represents Hitler's secret police. The artist tells CBC he only turns people away if they ask for face tattoos because they look, quote, too gang-related. He says he didn't refuse this one because it's what his customer wanted. We spoke to artists at five other shops in Regina. None of them would go on camera, but all of them said they would never do this tattoo. Some have already refused customers who have asked for hateful imagery, including swastikas. A few people on social media defended the artist, saying he was just doing his job, but hundreds of others criticized him. One of his former clients says she'll never go back after seeing this post, which has since been deleted. Experts say the tattoo follows an increase in anti-Semitism. A yearly audit on anti-Semitic incidents in Canada recorded more than 2,000 last year for the first time ever. If you try and view it neutrally, you, you could do that, but it wouldn't be a very convincing argument because I think everyone knows what that symbol is. It's not really something that's a, a secret. It's not even coded. It's a very explicit message. Regina Rabbi Jeremy Parnes is concerned about the trend, but says he's happy to see people speaking up against the tattoo online. When good, good people do nothing, the worst will occur. So we can't be silent. We have to make an appropriate response. I'm not saying that we have to get aggressively inappropriate, but we mustn't let it be silent and we mustn't let it continue. The man who got the tattoo wouldn't give his reasoning for it but he later told CBC he will be getting the swastika covered up. He says he plans to go back to the same artist. Alex Saladuga, CBC News, Regina.